Hey guys, so this is part two of the answers to the questions that you guys had asked me, asked, asked me. Um, so I'm going to go to the video. Um, Daryl, tell them what we're going to do about the winner and stuff. Um, we'll message you. No, we'll pick another, the second winner in this video. Oh yeah, we're picking the second winner in this video. So, oh, thank you Clover. Clover. That was Clover's commentary. Stop, 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 stop. She wants the string. I know. Okay, where were we at? Mm. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Okay. Are we ready? Yep. Okay. What is one important thing you want to teach your children as they, they grow up? Clover, stop it. Not to eat strings. <laughs> teach them that everybody is equal and that you know no matter who you love or what color you are or any of that stuff of what religion and all that stuff you know we're all people and you should treat everybody with respect so that is one thing I want to teach Clover what do you want to teach Clover to question everything and don't just accept that someone who is in charge is telling you to do the right thing because not all not everyone in charge is telling you to do the right thing so i don't want my kid to be one of those kids that goes into school and then the school takes her stuff from her because it's against the school rules if i gave it to her she owns it she keeps it and if the school wants to complain about it guess what they can talk to me about it and they better not take it from her because i didn't play that when i was a kid if i bought it you were either going to pay me for it or you weren't getting it. It was that simple. I didn't care if I got suspended for it because it was mine. No, I didn't carry knives or anything to school. But just simple stuff. If it's mine and it's not hurting anyone, don't question me about it. Okay. Are you going to go with names that only start with C or that have the same kind of theme? Yes, we mentioned that. We want to try to do a plant name theme or meadow. yeah like meadow it. theme or a nature theme kind of. nature theme so and we're doing seasons for middle names so yes um do you plan to move into a bigger home with another wee one on the way um we have enough rooms in this place yeah right? we have enough rooms in this place it's we three hope, bedrooms we hope to be in pennsylvania though so probably a three bedroom apartment or maybe like rent a house if mm. it's you know fits in our budget and stuff um what are your signs, meaning when is your birthday and when is his birthday? Uh, Pisces. Uh, I'm an Aries. Aries. When is your birthday? Yeah. March 10th. <coughs> Mine is April 3rd and Clover. What are, What is Clover? Clover is January Aquarius. 25th. January 25th. I meant her, oh, sign, her sign, babe. I don't know. She's an Aquarius. No. Yes, she is. It's like Aquarius Pisces, which no, Aquarius is like No, she's February. an Aquarius. Look, I'll show you. I'll show you guys, because I love to be right when we're talking to Daryl. Bam. January 20th to February 18th is an Aquarius. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, that would make sense. So, yes. That means Clover will be clever. Pun. Um, how old are you both? 29. And I'm 22. And Clover, how old are you? Six months. You're big. Yeah, I'm like... Oh, what is you, mommy? No. <laughs> Don't insult my age. You're as old as daddy. <laughs> Did you find it? Do you find it hard to be away from your family and friends in Pittsburgh? Oh, uh, somewhat, yes. Shout out to you for knowing where we're from. Loves Sunshine Fifty Eight. Yep. I talk to most of my friends online for the most part. We always have funny Facebook conversations and just uh. Lots of inside jokes from Which high me. school. <laughs> and I talked to my family, and my best friend lives in Alaska. My childhood Hi. best friend lives in Pittsburgh. Um, we don't talk as much as I would like to talk, but we do talk still. Clover. And um, yeah, I talked to my family, and I talked to Daryl's friends too. What's she so to do? What's your, what she wants to get in? your phone, probably. Yeah, she probably wants to get my phone. Or she um, wants to get that salsa. Why have you decided <laughs> to have another baby with an infant? We want to get it over with faster. <laughs> really, why? I don't know. We just decided one day that we wanted another one. 
honestly, we I wanted them to be close together. I like that they will have each other to go up with. I like that when we go on family vacations and stuff, they'll be doing the same things. Like if they have to go to Kitty Land, they'll both be in Kitty Land. Um, just like, and honestly, I love being a mommy and he loves being a daddy. So, plus, who wouldn't want another one of these? <laughs> you want a brother or sister? No. No. I want to be spoiled. Oh, my, 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 my. You're still going to be spoiled. Okay. Then you Which can one? Have as many as you can spoil me with. Just two. Which one do you want? I want one. Which one do you want? <laughs> me. No. <laughs> no. Do you want a brother or a sister? Oh, a sister. You like a girl? Because I'm going to give her all my clothes and then I'll be like, ha ha, you're two years out of date. Oh my goodness. A year, babe. Okay. A year or two years. Um, six months. I don't care. It's just you're out of date and I'm the one in shape. Whatever. I don't care. <laughs> Are you hoping for a girl or a boy this time around? They better have a girl because I'm giving her my stuff. If it's a boy, he could be mad. What do you want, Daryl? Girl's fine because... Neither of us would be sad if we had a boy or anything. Yeah. But we have a lot of girl stuff. So. And girl names are easier to come up with. And they're cuter. Like, girl ah. names are cuter to me. Although I was thinking about another boy name that I'll tell you later. Okay. That's actually kind of like a unisex name. Okay. This question is from Daryl's friend, Pamela. He doesn't actually know her in real life, but. Why is it my friend? Because you always like reply to our comments and stuff. Oh, right, yeah. So, and she bought us the boppy pillow that Clover has, so thank you. Um, do you ever get frustrated? <laughs> this is an interesting question, Daryl. Do you ever get frustrated that you have to manage the household even when he's off for his monthly break, cooking, laundry, etc.? I know that he works a lot outside of your home the rest of the weeks, but I've always wondered that. I hate having to come home and work some more. She's talking about your weeks off. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I hate having to come home and work um, more by doing stuff on my weeks off. I feel I should be able to. Ow, Clover! She's asking about how I feel about it. Oh. Okay. Um, I get frustrated sometimes, but it's only when he won't do, like, simple things. Like, he's supposed to take out the garbage, and sometimes I'm like, why can't you take it out? Like, just stupid stuff. But, like, I don't get mad that I have to do, like, the dishes and stuff. Like, that's kind of just what I do, so. I'm used to it. I do wish Daryl knew how to cook, though. You like her sit down? Stand up. Sit down, stand up. Sit down, stand up. <laughs> sit down, stand up. <laughs> sit down, stand up. Sit down, stand up. Okay. Um. Are you ready? Okay. So. Um, are you and Daryl going to name this baby something unique like Clover as well? I think Aria would be a really cute name. I think Reina is unique too. I think I'm, I kind of think I made it up in my head. I was dreaming one night that Clover's name was Reina. This is when I was still pregnant with Clover. And I actually tried to convince Daryl to switch the name to Reina and he wouldn't do that. No. I said if so. we have another girl, she can pick the name. Um, I also really like the name Lux for a girl, but I didn't think he would like that at all. No. It means light. I like it for a boy, too. Um, is that the one you're talking about? Yeah. Is but, it like L-U-X? Yeah, Lux. Mm. Which thing's cute. Like it means Lux like, Luthor. No, it means like <laughs> Spider-Man's arch nemesis. Who didn't know he was going to go there? That's what all the kids are going to say. <laughs> you got kryptonite on you today? The See, kids, even Clover's Darryl, on Daryl, no kids watch that movie. 